Today we're going to review basic jam removal procedures on the Hewlett Packard M1536. The first place you want to look for jams on this machine when making copies or faxing is the document feeder. So in this top piece here, this main cover lid will pull back. You can check right in here for paper jams. And as well, this piece here is loose. There's little flaps on each side. You can lift this up and then remove paper from inside here. You can close this up. You can also open this lid then, make sure that there's no paper stuck right in this area here. Uh, and underneath, right in this area here, if there's any paper. You may also need to open the back of the printer up to remove jams in the duplex assembly. This is done by pulling the back door open, removing the, any jammed paper from this area here, and then closing the door back up. The next place to check for jams when printing is in the paper tray. You can check right in here for paper jams, and then remove the toner cartridge from the machine by lifting the lid, the document feeder scanner assembly lid, then opening the printer lid, pull the toner cartridge out, look, check straight down here for any paper jams, and then this piece right here with the little green tab is the fuser output assembly. You just want to pinch this in and kind of pull it towards you about a quarter inch, it'll snap forward and then drop down and check right in here for paper jams. To close it, you just lift it straight back up and then push in. And then reinsert your toner cartridge, close both lids, and the machine will be ready to print once again. This is how you clear basic paper jams on the Hewlett Packard M1536.